Let's get more details now from Sharon Waxman of the website TheWrap.com, which broke the story of the deal. Good morning, Sharon. Good morning. NBC does now confirm this is a done deal. What do you know about the terms? Well, we've already known most of the terms, which is that Conan is going to get about $30 million uh, to make himself feel better for having lost this prize that he'd been waiting for for so long. And the whole package is about $40 billion. That includes severance and payout deals for a lot of the other big people on the show. So it's, it's a pricey package. I know that severance for his staff was very important to him. In fact, Conan's manager issued a statement, which I'd like to put up, which says, in the end, Conan was appreciative of the steps that NBC made to take care of his staff and crew and decided to supplement the severance they were getting out of his own pocket. Now he just wants to get back on the air as quickly as possible. Mm -hmm. So he's taking some of his own money for his crew? Yeah. I, he's done that before, by the way. When there was a writer strike, uh, Conan continued to pay his staff. So this has been a, 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 an issue that's been playing out in the media, the gossip columns, that Conan won't pay his staff. Oh, yes, he will. So there's been a lot of maneuvering. It's, it's been about how much the staff's right. going to get, but uh, apparently he's going to pay out of his own pocket, yeah? Sounds like they're taken care of. Yeah. What a financial hit NBC took. $40 million for the Conan deal, not to mention everything they spent on marketing this show, Mm -hmm. getting a new set, getting it on the air. Even so, wouldn't it have been even more expensive to get rid of Jay and keep It Conan? would have. It would have cost more money to get rid of Jay. But all of this has to be put in the context of how much money NBC is losing and its affiliates have been losing in terms of ad dollars because they, they can't maintain the same ad sales rate at the, at the ratings that they've been getting. So they're hoping that they're going to be able to put the genie back in the bottle mm -hmm. or put the bottle pieces back together in terms of the financial math that makes that made this whole change work not work and that was working better before Jay Leno went off at 11.35. But that's still the big question. Will the viewers come back? Will the ratings go back to where they were? And the irony, of course, is that Conan's ratings have been through the roof exactly. since this whole thing started. So Conan's last day is reportedly tomorrow. tomorrow. When is Jay's first day back on The Tonight Show? He's supposed to be back, I believe, March 1st. March 1st. And then when can Conan go back on TV somewhere else? Well, first of all, yeah, Conan can't do anything else until September. Okay. So we don't know where he's going to go. And everything's under a media blackout. So those great jokes we been hearing every night. Uh, he's not going to be allowed to slam NBC with impunity for at least a few months. <laughs> Darn. <laughs> Sharon, thank you very Thanks. much. Good to have you.